What is going on, everybody? It is Thursday, the day before the huge Bowman release. Wow. Bowman is just going up in price um, with the mandated sales. And it deals with a lot of you guys probably heard me say it. Every person got cut 10% of their order. And then on top of it, we didn't even get it all in. You're lucky it probably gets shipped about 30 35% of your order, if that. I, I Mine's lower. I know that. Um... I only have two boxes of Hobby and a box of Jumbo coming in on this order. It's insane. Uh, so we are going to break it, though. I had to look at it. Uh, Hobby's going for 300 a box now. And it's just basic due to supply and demand. Uh, Jumbo was creeping at 500 I do have Mosaic, but it doesn't make sense to break it because a single Hobby box of Mosaic is over 700 uh, I'm seeing seven. Well, yesterday late it was over seven hundred, close to seven fifty average a box. So I don't think anybody really wants to break mosaic. So we'll cancel that out. I'm just going to throw those up for sale on my slabs. Bowman, we're going to give it a shot. I've ran numbers every which way because I wanted to throw some clearly authentic in with it, uh, just so there's an extra auto into it. So. When I started figuring out the prices on to it, it made more feasible sense to do a single box of Bowman with two boxes of Clearly Authentic, just so we can get that extra little two autos for a pop into there. And, you know, Clearly Authentic has a lot of bang for a buck. Everything will ship in the Bowman to include paper. Um, I do have a few combo teams. It'll be a total of 24 spots. The first combo team is actually combo teams. It's the Reds, Rockies, and Twins. The second combo team is Indians and Pirates. The next one will be the Angels and Blue Jays. Yes, the Blue Jays do have Bichette, but what I've learned with Bowman is the rookie cards do not flow as much as the first Bowman, so it's not going to be like, oh, you're going to get Bichette in every single case. So I'm just, I was just trying to pair some of this stuff up. Um, Giants and Phillies are together. Cardinals and D-backs are together. Everybody else is standalone their teams. It will be random teams, just like we ran before. You pick your spot number, and then we just random the teams, and we break. I figured this would be probably the cheapest way to break Bowman by doing it that way. If the first one goes and sells out quick, I'll put a second one up there, same exact way, and we'll push that as well. I remember Monday is a federal holiday, so mail will not be pushed out until Tuesday, even though we're going to break this on Saturday. Here's a catch. If you guys uh, fill this up on Friday, I will break the first mixer Friday night, and I'll have it shipped out Saturday to you. I would say it would have to fill by like 10 p.m. Eastern. So as soon as I get that product in, I see the little UPS guy. He comes up to my porch because I'll be out uh, getting some work done. I, I see him put it in the porch. I'm ceasing fire. I'm coming down. I'll release it. I will do a video. It'll be like a two-minute video. Well, I, three, I think, is what YouTube wants. Well, I'll still throw a video up saying, hey, it's in the store. Go grab it. I'll shoot it on the business page of Facebook, not the Facebook group, the business page itself. So everybody knows it's on it, and I will send a mass email out that the first Bowman breaks in the store. Uh, by doing it the way with one box, clearly, let me just do this again. I think I had it down pretty good with uh, shipping and everything. Let me grab it again here. Be $19 a spot. So if you're interested, I mean... Make sure you go to the store and you subscribe to the email. That way you get it. But check your spam folders because a lot of the emails are getting pushed to people's spam. So make sure it's allowed there. Check the YouTube videos. Make sure you're subscribed and you hit that bell. Because once I balance it tomorrow, I don't know if this is going to go very quick. Because normally our stuff takes about uh, probably about 24 hours to, to fill with the other mixers. But this being Bowen might go a lot quicker. So... Once I get the other Bowman in, either if it's next week or the week after, we'll look at breaking that stuff too. And even if Bowman increases, I'll keep it still at the same price range on to it for now. 
unless I get mandated that I have to raise costs. And everybody does understand that, you know, <clears throat> I do have a license. I have to play by Panini rules, distributor rules, and all that other stuff, too. So I, I will uh, do the best I can with the pricing on this stuff, and we'll go from there. Also, there will be a giveaway tomorrow as well. Believe it or not, everything I wanted to do for a giveaway for uh, some of the stuff it was all sold out. So I came up with something different. It, it's really nice, uh, cool giveaway for tomorrow, too. But I always wanted to come on here real quick. No, these are not the giveaway cards. They're just something to put on the screen. It was laying on the side. I did put cards in the store yesterday. My intent was also to say, hey, I stocked the store up. But some people already caught it last night. And I think it was something like... 45 cards went out last night. There's still some of the stuff that I did put in there last night. It's in the store. So if you guys are interested, check Extreme Card Breaks out. Uh, ExtremeCardBreaks.com, I should say. There are some of those cards still available in there. But uh, all everybody's order went out today. Even if you place it like way in the uh, early morning hours, I got it out during lunch today. And I do appreciate everybody using the store uh, to pick up the stuff. And I think uh, in the future, I'm going to limit myself now to only two to three card shows a year because I like the way the website's going to where everybody can just go on there and pick it out. And I still get to, I could go to a card show and be more of a buyer than sitting behind a table selling all day to where I can't go out there and get deals and be able to post that stuff in the store for everybody. So I do appreciate it and everything. Other than that, if you guys have any questions about the Bowman stuff, uh, please leave it down there. If you feel like you guys want to go completely insane and do both hobby boxes, and I'll just throw in like two boxes of Clearly, you're probably going to look at something like, let me just look here. I, I don't want to give you guys wrong prices on to it. I, I just got to do the math up real quick, and I'm not even... Uh, It would be like twenty nine bucks a spot if I would add a box of another box of Bowman hobby to that break, but I, I think it'd be better if we just stick with the one box Bowman two clearlies at nineteen. That way, uh, if you get stuck with a team that doesn't hit at all, it, it's not a, a real big hit onto the wallet for right now. Plus, you know, I'll have Bowman coming in a week, maybe two weeks later. Nobody knows the answer to that question. But other than that, I do appreciate it, everybody. I didn't realize I was going that long in this video. I just wanted to cover a bunch of aspects at once. Didn't really write out my note card to keep it uh, around five minutes. All right, everybody. Hopefully, everybody had a good week. I know it's Memorial Day weekend as well. Stay safe out there. If you plan on doing some traveling, I don't get to see you this weekend. Other than that, thank you. I will see you guys tomorrow live in the evening. Not too sure what we'll be doing, but I'll come live for a little bit. Talk to you later.